Well, surprise, you got Bonnie instead of Pastor Courtney and Pastor Michael this morning. I want to share some verses from the book of James, which I find meaningful, and I sure hope you will too. Well, okay, Martin Luther didn't even like the book of James. He said it shouldn't be in the Bible. It's a book of straw. Um, but we know that James was not a disciple of Jesus. He came along later and uh, followed Paul. Some have compared the book of James to the Old Testament book of Proverbs because it is um, dealing with wisdom and uh, action. And I'm always looking to gain wisdom for my actions. Let me read a few passages from the beginning of James. My sisters and brothers, whenever you face trials of any kind, consider it nothing but joy, because you know that the testing of your faith produces endurance. And let endurance have its full effect so that you may be mature and complete, lacking in nothing. The early Christians faced many trials. They were tested, and we sure have been, haven't we, this last year? Uh, um, endurance usually means withstanding hardships or adversities. Um, has it had a, its full effect on you? Have you become more mature and complete? as the passage in James says. As people of faith, we are reminded that God is here and ready to listen. So maybe that's the mature part, really, really believing in the nearness of God. I know my soul is more peaceful when I take time to quiet myself and have a meaningful dialogue with God. Well, how about the joy part? Have you been able to find joy in the midst of this pan pandemic? I think it's pretty great that we have all kinds of emotions, including joy. I find joy in lots of little things, like my granddaughter when she sends me a funny text from college, or when I've mastered, well, almost some new computer skill, and maybe these beautiful sunsets that we've been having, and reading a good book, especially when I can sit in the park on a sunny day. And a phone call or a card from one of you. Back to the endurance part. In chapter five says, indeed, we call blessed those who showed endurance. Well, my friends, just like our faith ancestors, you are blessed. And as God said to Abraham, you are blessed to be a blessing. Amen. <laughs> 